Good Friday in Jerusalem is an intense experience. A crowd prayed along the way of the cross, the Via Dolorosa, the streets that Jesus walked carrying the cross. But it is the evening event that gathers the biggest crowd. At the funeral procession in the Basilica of the Holy Sepulchre, they sing the biblical texts on the death and burial of Jesus. He who saw it has testified, and his testimony is true, were the clear and rousing words of the evangelist St. John, who was at the foot of the cross of Jesus together with the Virgin Mary. The liturgy celebrated today by the friars of the Franciscan custody of the Holy Land recalls what happened over 2,000 years ago. Joseph of Arimathea asked Pilate for permission to take Jesus' dead body to prepare it for burial, and Nicodemus assisted him in the burial. They took Jesus' body and bound it in linen cloths with the spices, as is the burial custom of the Jews. The same gesture is repeated today by the Custos of the Holy Land, Father Pier Battista Pizzaballa, and by the Franciscans. At the place where he was crucified there was a garden, and in the garden a new tomb, in which no one had ever been laid. The narrative is full of details that are repeated today, the excitement of the liturgy in the silence of contemplating the great mystery and awaiting the morning of resurrection.